So where does the organ come from? Wow. Um, we kind of stole it from yeah. a band. Oh, not a band. A <laughs> no, we actually stole it from a really good friend of ours. Yeah. It sort of, it sort of ended up in the studio and never left. And then even though the friend kind of progressed and moved on, uh, yeah. the organ stayed behind. Happily well, so. Our friend's really nice. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, we said that for our friend. So when he hears this, he doesn't get bleak. <laughs> Hey and gosh. then it, it went through, we started playing it on yeah. stage, we actually never planned to play it. Um, and then as the sound grew, we kind of threw the organ in. And it was great on stage, but the problem was, you know, it's got, it's got these two speakers. Um, and we used to have to mic it up on stage. 
and that was hell, like absolute hell. I mean, like there were like only five out of ten times where the organ actually do its job on stage. Um, but it was great. And then we started. We got yeah, outputs did, installed, and now it yeah, we got outputs yeah. installed, and now we can put it through a valve amp and pedals and all sorts of fun things. Um, but we're really glad to yeah. have it on the new album. I mean, the previous and, and album, it comes through beautifully. We yeah. we hardly used organ, and then we sort mm -hmm. of got it fixed, and then after that. Like it's just it's in about just about mm. every song now in the new one, so, so it, a, it plays a very pivotal role yeah. in the new sound and the new album. things that we've um, we've never been afraid to do and it's almost like a rule with us is that like we don't we don't stop ourselves from letting a song evolve um, often after we've put the finishing touches on a tune and we like think it's good and we've even played it like at a gig um, we'll be playing it one night in the studio and something will pop up and we'll suddenly you know decide shit let's do something different with the song um, and it's something we've gotten better and better at doing is like not being too strict with the structure of a tune um, and being kind of a little more free to like mess around with our tunes and let them continue to evolve all the time.
you've been watching Wild Eats and Arches at the Big Leap Studios. Um, our new album that we've been working extensively on will be coming out in mid-September. So keep an eye out for that. It's going to be interesting.